Welcome back, Math Grizz. Today, we will determine fractions of a set. What fraction of the counters are red? Here we have a set of counters. We need to figure out the fraction of these counters that are red. We will start by finding the numerator. The numerator is the number above the fraction bar. This stands for how many of the counters are red. So let's look at this set and count how many red counters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The numerator is seven because this set of counters has seven red counters. The denominator is the total number of counters in this set. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The denominator is eight. We can say that seven eighths of these counters are red. What about yellow? We can say that one eighth of the counters are yellow. What fraction of the counters are red? Again, we have a set of counters. We need to figure out the fraction of them that are red. We'll start by figuring out the numerator. The numerator stands for how many are red. Let's look at the set. One, two, three, four. Four of the counters are red. Remember, for the denominator, we need to find how many total counters in this set. One, two, three, four, five, six. The denominator is six. We can say that four sixths of these counters are red. What fraction of the counters are red? Here we have another set of counters. We need to figure out the fraction of them that are red. Remember, the numerator stands for how many of them are red. One, two, three. The numerator has to be three. And the denominator stands for how many total counters in this set. One, two, three, four. We can say that three fourths of the counters are red. Now, what fraction of the counters are yellow? We can say that one fourth of the counters are yellow. Oh.